is hard to watch. Zoe wobbling, looking vulnerable. Kick to the stomach puts an end to that. Reversal on top of reversal. And they just busted out an impactful maneuver. Zoe with the retaliation. Comes in off the tag. Point. No superstar is showing signs of backing down. We are seeing all their best on display, but it might just come shoulders down. Championship on the line. And there's the save. It's coming. Back in the leg here. Oh, look at the tail of this line. Handle clutch. She's in a tremendous amount of pain. Is she going to tap? She hold on. This is absolutely excruciating. It's hard to watch. She should tap. Quite the predicament for her here, but she's able to slip through and reverse the move. Boom, nice. The challenger's looking shaken. What energy in the arena tonight. Oh, that stays alive. She's getting back to her feet, but is there fight left? She gets it. Oh, Big time throws on. Good grief. Wicked roundhouse kick. Oof. Retaliated with a knee to the face. She's going to try it again. Oh, Lions with a split legged leg drop. The champ will stay champ. Here's the pin to retain. She kicks out with force. How is the challenger still in this match? Tremendous pressure being applied in this head crank. Oh, man. 
Looks like her opponent's not going to need a chiropractor. Oh, that backfired on her. Ooh, sharp kick. Momentum is pivoted toward Takeda. Natalya needs to find an opening fast. Tag made. Tag made. She was clearly waiting for that. This is what champions are made of. Always finding that deepest ounce of willpower, that final drop of fuel in the reserve. There's not a single person sitting in this arena. It's pandemonium, Cole. Nikita telling her opponent to bring it on. Kicking combination. Measuring. Uh oh. It's reversed on Nikita. Working the midsection there. Going up on the middle rope. Striking the lower back. Now the superstar from the apron. Knee lifts over and over again. Looking for a Move. Sky high. Uh oh, got snatched up here. Oh, in the outside. Two. Three. There's a supreme woman in our midst. Show some respect, WWE Universe. Natalya turns the tables. Running knee lift. With the championship on the line. Got it. And the tag titles change hands here tonight. Here's another look at some of the previous action, giving their fans their money's worth and more. Here are your winners, and the new WWE Women's Tag Team Champions, Sarah and Natalya. And the winners celebrating together. Great chemistry tonight. Each of these women could contend for a title alone, but together, they may never lose a match. Saxton. The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 417 pounds, Xavier Woods and Kofi Kingston, the New Day. You know, the only thing worse than this pancake and unicorn parade is that I know for a fact these guys are going to launch their clothes at me. <laughs> Don't be a negative Nancy, Corey. That's just part of the fun. It's not fun. And they need to fire whoever's doing their laundry. Oh, look out, Corey. Look out. <laughs>
summoned from Valhalla. They are ready for battle. And their opponents at a combined weight of 552 pounds, Eric and Ivar, the Viking Raiders. Two big, bad, scary dudes who have run roughshod over the tag team division. Yeah, two absolute wrecking balls who are thirsty for demolition. It's a terrifying blend of size, speed, power, and agility. When you see these two behemoths walking towards you, a lot of people would argue the match is already over before the bell rings. Representatives of the New Day out here for this match. New Day loves to have fun, but guys, this is a tag team that could easily be considered one of the greatest of all time. Especially when they get rolling in the ring. New Day loves to pick up the pace, get the action going, and get the crowd pumping. Absolutely, Byron. And you can bet they'll try to do that here in this one. And across the ring are the formidable duo of Eric and Ivar. The Viking Raiders. Berserker energy with the athleticism of a triathlete. There are few teams who can do what the Viking Raiders do. Not to mention, they can crush a horn of ale. Like, literally, I've seen them crush it. Sequence of reversals here. Both superstars clearly studied game tape ahead of time. Set him up. Russian leg sweep. Placed in the corner now, and able to beat Woods to the punch. Overhand right lands. Oh, flipping the script on him there. Uh-oh. Hooked up. Oh, great power. Inverted suplex. This match grinded him down a little. Just cranking the head. That's gotta hurt. Just cranking the head. Followed up by another to the chest. Exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. And he tosses it back in now. Three. You see that propelled through the air. He's struggling a bit here. Yeah, they've stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. Ooh. Hooked up. NET. And then into the corner. Oh, trapped in the corner and series of punches. Oh, he's got him in deep, deep trouble. Hey, look out. A slight shot right across the back of the neck. Ouch. Bang. Oh, impressive counter. These two showing how. Looks out of it. Go B Kingston. Yeah. How about a little? Boom, drop. Eric slowly rising to what may be his demise. Out of the way. Oh, super kick. What a counter. He's bad. Section. Beautiful athleticism. DDT. Fresh man in. Oh, yeah. Here we go. He can end it here. He's got him. Big time close line. Good grief. Face. 
Kick to the gut. Double the under hook. Top the Is it enough? Put the cover. Still not enough to put him away. Got the tag. Got the tag. He steers clear of contact. See a kick out there and off the tag. Uh oh. And Eric with the count. Oh, elbow smash. How much longer can these superstars continue to fend off defeat? Every obstacle has been met with equal measures of tenacity. It's going to take a. Uh oh. Denied via a wicked punch to the stomach. with his opponent. With a wheelbarrow face buster. Oh. Listen to this place. It's electric. Now Woods could be closing in. Hooked up. Got a small package driver. Woods might have this wrapped up. Whatever tag team is on the docket, the mayhem multiplies. Here's the proof. Here are your winners. Xavier Woods and Kofi Kingston. The New Day. Xavier Woods leads the team to victory. For my money, these two just might be the best tag team on the roster today. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Long Island, New York, Chris. Here's someone who has faced some tough odds and tougher opponents, but always gives it their all. Look, I, I know you think that's a good thing, but this person could learn a thing or two about the value of running and hiding. Oh, uh, yes, the value of being a coward. such a talented competitor, I think we're about to see one of her best matches yet.
Not afraid to fight, knows how to survive. And she's pretty fun to watch inside the ring, too. And here's a woman on a mission. She has the singular goal of being the most dominant superstar in the women's division. And she has no issue getting in your face about it either. She doesn't care who she has to run over. There is no second place for her in any competition. And she's up against the always unpredictable Shotzi, who's an absolute cannonball once she's in the ring. Yeah, I don't know how anyone can keep up the type of energy that Shotzi brings once she's in the ring. She's full speed from bell to bell. She adjusts it and reverses it. Catches the leg. Able to counter with a takedown. Boom! What a forearm! Vicious backdrop suplex. Oh, yeah. She is really getting fired up. Raped across the top rope. Superstars on the WWE roster. Corey, I imagine it has to be hard for opponents to overcome that chaotic style of hers. Yeah, if you're trying to predict Shotzi's next move, she'll already have you beat. What you have to do is stick to your own plan and keep the pressure up on her. Sooner or later, Shotzi's chaos will end up coming back to bite her. Oh, this is one of the most incredible comeback, and it proved to be well telegraphed. Places her right in the corner. Face first in the turnbuckle. Forearm smash. This is just establishing dominance, followed by the stomp. Hot run in the stomach creates the separation. Looks like some words have been exchanged. And the language is telling me they might not have been the kindest. Slice bread number two. That absolute explosivity from Shotzi. I don't even think her opponent realized what hit her until it was too late. And it was offense with a powerful purpose. She did her homework. A big knockdown. Oh, she can't take advantage of the opening. Jaw rocking knee lift. Boom, right to the jaw. Oh, you can pick up your teeth in section 112. Shotzi's so composed, so in control now. Yeah, Shotzi following through on her motto and taking care of business. Shotzi might have this in the bag for the win. Two count. It's unthinkable. Someone beating the one count at this point? You got to give a lot of credit here. Withstanding what has taken out many other competitors. Looking for a high-risk, high-reward situation. She wants it one more time. She comes up empty. A oh, big knockdown. Can't find a way to rally there. Yeah. German suplex. This match is wearing her down. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble a superstar exposes themselves to. You have to imagine we're hitting the late stages of this matchup. Who's going to dig deeper at this point? It might just take that extra push, that extra inch further to create the difference. Uh, uh, Shotzi caught by the counter. Shotzi holds her up. Reversal after reversal. These two down. There you go. And again. Picking up momentum. Feeding off adrenaline. Shoulder right in the midsection. This is just establishing dominance. Oh, what a stop right to the chest. Are you kidding me? Oh, 
Electric chair. Oh, this is scary. Face buster. Shotzi staggers up, struggling to regain any composure. Oh, right to the midsection. Set them up. Last submission locked in. Taps out. Hold the phone. They're wanting to join in on the celebration, but not quite sure what to make of it. Yeah, none of us are. What is the meaning of this? Here comes Jey Uso. A man who has grown immeasurably under the bloodline. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from San Francisco, California, weighing in at 242 pounds. Main event, Jey Uso. What a lineage, part of an all time great dynasty. Yeah, but Jey Uso reached new heights in his career alongside the bloodline. He may primarily be a tag team competitor, but in singles action, Jey Uso is as big a threat as anybody on the roster. A Lucha Libre megastar now looking to dominate WWE. I'd say there's a very good chance he'll do that. And his opponent, representing Legado del Fantasma from Mexico City, Mexico, weighing in at 200 pounds, Santos Escobar. Well, it's time to pay respect to the boss of the street. Santos Escobar does not play games. Escobar is calm, steady, calculated, and does whatever he has to do to succeed. Santos Escobar continues to build his empire, and he'll do anything to keep it intact. Escobar is determined to provide and protect his family. Beware, he's full of surprises. We'll start with Santos Escobar, the self-styled emperor of Lucha Libre. What does that even mean, Corey? Santos sees himself as tradition and modernity all in one. He honors the past with old school lucha moves, but pushes into the future with modern presentation and technique. He understands the best way to keep tradition alive is to allow it to grow and change. And if I may add, he's completely ruthless to boot. And staring him down is Jey Uso, a superstar who is a true natural in the ring. Hailing from a legendary bloodline of sports entertainment legends, including Hall of Fame father. Jey Uso was born to do this and has applied a cold-hearted approach to his own legacy. Jay knows when he gets in the ring, he represents one of the most dominant families in our history. I think his refusal to let them down is admirable, whatever the cost may be. Jay's gonna make his family proud. Ouch. A uh, reversal catches Santos. Oh, drop kick. We're seeing a new element of brutality to Jey Uso's in-ring approach. Do you think that works in his favor tonight? Absolutely it does. Jey Uso is more dangerous than ever. I don't think any opponent can be fully prepared for Jey's streak of relentless intensity. The more he lets that come out to play, the bigger his advantage will be tonight. I oh, knew what was coming. And what a reversal from Jey Uso. Oh, close line. Look at this. What a cross body. That is.
his reckless abandon being shown. And paying off as well. Now, that was a hair-brained idea to try that. Was trying to find a way to attack, but completely wiped out. Whip back into the ring. Saw that one coming. Popped up. So oh. I dropped by Jay Uso. I think Jay's making a great addition to this family's legacy with that kind of brutal impact. Top row. So splash. Jay nailed all of it. This is what you call high risk, high reward. Strongest top row. For sure this thing was wrapped up. Well, stay in your seat. Looks like we've got a ways to go yet. Main event, Jey Uso with a close call right there. He definitely thought he had that one in the bag. Oh, my God, what a move. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. He finds a counter for Jay. Oh, look at this. What grace float over the DDT! Fight! Ooh. Launch out to the outside! That was coming in hot at breakneck speed. Going fast and living dangerously. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Jay taking his offense to the top rope. From the top. Oh, a oh, a piercing elbow. Taking a chance one more time and landing with incredible impact. From the top. No, no, no. Move that out of the way. Kick to the gut. Hammerlock applied. Hammerlock sits in, followed by a suplex. And I'm sure Jay's bloodline didn't like what they saw there. Santos went a little old school with that one, I think. Great display of power to the German. Effectively using the knee. Jeez, and now Escobar has damage to his face. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Look at this. Ooh, that might have just broken something. Some good contact by Jey Uso. Off point. He turns it around. A fireman's carry. Into the foot slam. Look out. Oh, no. You have daring and you have stupid. That was stupid. It was a daring decision that didn't provide the expected result. Yeah, stupid. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. place for him to be right now. Enable to counter. These superstars must be feeding off the WWE Universe. This place is starting to rock. Oh, man, what a double knee strike. Right to the sternum. Off the ropes. Uh-oh. He's able to fend off the attack. Chop block. Right to the knee. An utterly relentless attack from Escobar. 
Yeah, Escobar is clearly in control. And Escobar didn't see that coming. Exclamation mark right there. I don't think anyone's questioning it. Top row. So splash by Jay. Will Jay end this? Two. Hard fought victory for this superstar tonight. And for, look at this. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's the meaning behind this? We'll find out in due time, but the message was sent crystal clear. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Venice Beach, California, the baddest woman on the planet, Ronda Rousey. Rousey went undefeated for a full year in WWE and tonight looks ready to continue her dominance. Ronda Rousey's got her game face locked. She is ready to compete. We are about to see a martial arts masterpiece, both on the ramp and in the ring. to WWE. If you are a source of evil, Xia Lee will have no problem hunting you down. Or is Xia Lee herself the evil source? How about that, Saxton? First women superstar from China. We're about to see a master class in the martial arts. her incredible intensity inside the ring. She stares down her opponents with an unbreaking, steely gaze that can be very intimidating. Frankly, the way Ronda looks at her opponents puts even a little chill down my spine. It's as if she totally locks in on them, like a predator eyeing its prey. Well, that focus often delivers big results for Ronda as she tends to quickly destroy any opposition she sets her sights. From the top, far smash. This is just vicious. Boom! I really think Rousey should rely on her ground and pound skills tonight. It might be a bit brutal, but it's effective. We know that Rousey's obviously got strikes at her disposal, so why not turn this into a one-sided fight? Lee may be realizing that her competition won't be one to back down either. Ronda coming at her with incredible intensity. Right to the midsection. Effective 
massive arm drag. Oh, man, a little extra luster behind that kick. Oh, oh, oh. Climbing up to the top now. From way up, Fetty back with a counter. Rousey. Uh-oh. Zaya gets her back. Well, there's an arm breaker right to the spine. Hope you boys put your running shoes on. It might be time to clear out. Beautiful elbows. And a spinning back kick, too. Gotta find a way to get out of this. So good by Everyone get out of the way. These two are abandoning all the strengths. She sent back in under the ropes. Ronda now looking to go high risk. On the top, diving double axe handle. Watch her set up in the corner. Ooh, she just turned it around. Now there's an arm breaker right to the spine. The wheels are turning in Zaya's head. Spirit of Rousey keeps her alive a little longer. And now it's reload time. Time to find out a moment to pull off that one more time. Oh, drop. And Rousey caught off guard again right there. There's been plenty of action in this match, and the cost of that is really showing now. From the top, fought back with a punch to the gut. Oh, look at this. And had something going but can't finish the job. Finds a counter for Lee. A stalemate of counters. Effective. She's going for it. She gets the shoulder up. She just dug down deep there, but I don't know if she'll be able to do it again. A helpless Rousey being targeted. Oh, my. A leaping roundhouse kick. Zion got it. Can she end it? Shoulders down. Oh, a kick out. She's not done yet. The baddest woman on the planet absolutely refusing to let things end here and now. I don't know if there's more frustration or desperation in the ring now, knowing that you tried to end this and failed. And that might be the start of the momentum swing. Zion needed skills. A smothering offense from Lee here. Ooh, slows that down with a placed kick. Bodies must be writhing in pain right now. The breaking point must be on the horizon. Yet they continue forward, showing no desire to quit. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. She's about to rise up to something catastrophic. Turn out the from Zia Lee. That's got to do it. That's got to be it. So there's that. One, two. And a kick out. Rosie operating on reflexes with that one. It's about as close as she can come to a pinfall. Is there still enough left to try that maneuver again? Or is her confidence shaken? Lee proving that she can channel all of her fury into quite the lethal maneuver. Showing off just how dangerous she really is. Ah, oh, look at this. Hair pull that slam. And Rousey is being taken apart here. Seems like Rousey's been well scouted. This one is headed outside, guys. Point of the elbow, nailed it. Ah. Oh. 
Oh, man, looks like her opponent's not going to need a chiropractor. Zia Lee calling the audience to her side. Quick thinking pays off. And that could be a first step towards Ronda gaining control. That's possibly the trigger for Rousey to battle. Picking up speed, building momentum. She had something going there, but falls short. Yeah. 
Oh, look at this. I don't want to be part of these problems. Don't want to be part of this crowd. Gets out of the way. Uh oh. The sequence of reversals there. Oh, what a knee strike. so much energy to muster. Scratching and clawing, this could be it. Almost ended it there. Getting dangerously close to ending it all there. Rousey looking to inflict more damage, opponent up. Look at her answering back. She's calling for it. This went away even after that big maneuver. Soul kick. And she had Zion's number there. Ronda Rousey picks the ankle. And, and the ankle lock is cinched in. Oh my God. Some way they weathered the storm. Now let's take another look at these wonderful women in action. Here is your winner, the baddest woman on the planet, Ronda Rousey. An absolutely impressive performance and win here tonight. Practically an inhuman effort in terms of resilience on display throughout this match. You really have to hand it to them. They earned this victory. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 228 pounds, CM Punk. Just look at the swagger on display. I love it. Swagger. Really, Saxton? You know a number of people in the back just despise this superstar. Well, the WWE Universe clearly disagrees with you, Corey. Oh, and what else is new? Yeah. This is a match he's craved for quite some time. He's ready and raring to go. A promising young talent with a lot of swagger. And his opponent from Boston, Massachusetts, weighing in at 210 pounds, the WWE United States Champion, Carmelo Hayes. This guy is future star written all over him. 
A winner of the 2021 NXT Breakout Tournament, multiple-time NXT North American Champion, and unified that title with the Cruiserweight Championship. Go, go. He's got a cocky attitude, but a bad habit of backing it up. Mello ready to do something special. That's the bell, and this match is underway. Despite the title not being on the line, you have to imagine that there will be major championship implications should the challenger pick up the victory. Absolutely, Michael. He is betting on himself, and he truly believes that he can be the champ here tonight. And up against him is the supremely talented, supremely confident Carmelo Hayes. The only thing more dangerous than a confident man is a man who can back it up. Hayes is damn good and he knows it. We could be in for a show tonight, fellas. Targeting the neck, neck breaker. Neck breaker. Ouch. Carmelo Hayes has a lot going for him tonight, Corey, but what does he have going against him? Overconfidence. Carmelo deservedly believes his own height, but we know that can backfire too. Melo needs to keep his head in the game. Look at this, just unloading. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Carmelo dodges that attack. By uh, Hammerlock now, and Larian. And Hayes' confidence perhaps just got a little shaken. Boom! Cross body. Check out the springboard. Oh, look at this. Is it enough, guys? Is shot. it enough? Oh, and the comeback gets shut down. Oh, ouch. Great wherewithal on the counter. Scouted. Counters on counters. Technical prowess on display. Hayes now on the offensive. Big overhand. Vicious right forearm. He is just reeling from that offense. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. And he's able to reverse. Each competitor showing they've done their homework. Look at this beautiful, expertly executed combination of strikes and some kicks to follow. How many strikes to one superstar deliver? And a string of attacks like that can really gain you control. Oh, look at this. And his offense meets a brick wall. Climbing up top, he's got big plans. Oh, not the Hayes intended. Oh, look out. Crossbody to the top. Got all of it. Oh, it's not going to be pretty. Go to sleep, GTS. Night, night. That might have knocked Hayes out for good. And they're still in this. It was almost all over, almost a three count. Yeah, talk about a close call. How draining was that? Can it be done again? Can that maneuver be summoned?
just one more time. He eludes the contact. Well-placed punch, ugly, but effective response. Hayes is being cut down at every corner. And there's that overconfidence of Carmelo Hayes, which has backfired as he takes offense. Lands hard. Don't do it. Oh, God. That, that, that's a bad landing. A totally ill-advised decision there. Maybe slight hesitation there caused the outcome. Delivered into the barricade. Oh, man. Armbreaker takes him down. And he gets set back into the ring. And the unabated offense continues. Carmelo's not showing the capacity to fight back. Dropped with a knee to the body. Oh, no, there is more to come now. This time on the apron. Knee to the back of the neck. Respectful. Run out of ringside and back to the mat. Hayes, he's thinking big. a career-altering moment for these superstars, guys. But the spoils will only go to the victor, and I have a feeling we're close to finding out exactly who that will be. Springboard leg drop. Moves like that is why Carmelo has the confidence that he has. Done without a sweat. People simply can't do the things Melo does. Oh, that can rock you. The volume in this building has increased exponentially. The fans are willing these competitors to push forward. Win or lose, these superstars are going to be held in high esteem after this one. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Catches the clothesline. Unbelievable standing. He could pin his opponent right here. It's over. Oh, and a kick out. Kicked out. He kicked out. How does anyone kick out at this point? Kick to the gut. Hooked up. right back. Picking up speed, building momentum. Trying to change the tides of the match. No try, and the superstar has changed the tides of the match. If this works, it could change the course of the match. From the top rope. Oh, Strong impact. Oh, it's not going to be... Uh oh Fall off with an elbow. Kick to the gut. Hooked up. DDT. This building is rocking right now. Can you blame him? Look at that.
You can see Carmelo's eyes tracking the enemy now. Finds room, lands a jawbreaker. And it's not going to be proud. Hey, steers clear of that. That match might go down as one of the best matches in WWE history. Here is your winner, CM Punk. And with the results of this battle plain to see on their face, at least they can say they won the match. I don't know if I'd say the battle scars were worth it, Cole, but I will say the one who did it to them isn't the one celebrating right now. Well, here is a man who has captured the hearts of the WWE Universe, Sami Zayn. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 212 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Sami Zayn. Sami Zayn is a man who's always had the promise the potential, but he delivered on that promise and that potential when he took Roman Reigns to his absolute limit in a main event battle. Yeah, and now the entire world knows what Sami has always believed, that Sami Zayn is a main event talent who can reach the top of WWE. The WWE fans about to see Sami Zayn doing what he does best. Up to this point, Ricochet has seen plenty of success here in WWE. Won titles with his unbelievable agility. It's like Ricochet found the options menu for life and turned off the gravity option. Yeah, no camera tricks, no hidden wires. Ricochet, he's the real deal. Ricochet out here tonight for competition. One of the most innovative high flyers we've ever seen, guys. Yeah, Cole, Ricochet is definitely innovative, but he also still definitely has a chip on his shoulder. He has something to prove. Every flip and dive and even burst of energy is just his attempt to do that. Ricochet will absolutely have a chance to prove himself in this one. And unfortunately for all of us, he's in there tonight with Sami Zayn. This guy is just a parasite and a cheat. Never met a shortcut he didn't want to take loudly. You are a heathen and a buffoon, Saxton. You call Zayn a parasite, I call him a strategist. Sammy is always looking for the best path to victory, and he's pretty good at finding it. Does he cut a corner or two? Maybe. But you know what they say about ends and means. Not the position you want to be in right now. Sammy has the ability. Zayn 
Ricochet's been grabbed. How's he going to get out of this predicament? Elbows his way out. Bang! Vicious boot. Oh, a timely counter by Zayn. Chicken wing underhook. Uh oh. Some power behind that punch. Great counter. Set up in the corner of the ring. Drop kick. He's going for it all. Uh -uh. No way. Ricochet with the shooting star. That's Ricochet proving just how impressive he can be. Impressive, yeah, but more. Are you kidding me? Six thirty. Ricochet just put the exclamation point on this. Two count. Oh, he gets the shoulder up before three. I cannot believe that Sami Zayn wants to prolong this fight any further. What else does Ricochet need to do tonight? He's given everything, but still hasn't ended this. Watch out. Oh, wait a second. becomes a factor. Time to pull out all the stops. Able to parry that one. Ricochet is so evasive. These competitors have been going deep into their arsenal of all mass, but have not found a way to end it at all. Swings in momentum, every push has been cut off. He leaves the ring, but he could lose this match by count out. And now gets tossed into the ring. Headed to the top rope. Taking flight. Deserves another look. Here we go.
Here is your winner, Ricochet! Gotta hand it to our winner, standing tall with their arm raised tonight. Sami Zayn just suffered another miscarriage of justice. Oh, that's a shame. Guys, how excited are you for this tag team match? I can barely sit still. These two teams could have the match of the year. Oh. What is this team doing out here? I don't they're know. Not involved. Well, they're involved now. They're beating the hell out of the team, and I think maybe they have uh, their eyes set on a match with the team already in the ring. They can't just wipe out the team and take their place. Well, Saxon, it looks to me like they just did. Exactly. There, there's no way the referee's going to let this happen. Well, I believe the referee is going to let it happen. Okay, I've seen it all now. Maybe you should file a formal complaint, Byron. Wait, wait, where's my pen? Looks like we're gonna have a different match than actually was scheduled. Well, I hope the team that was attacked isn't too seriously injured. Go ahead, Saxton. Go backstage and check on them. Cole and I will watch this battle. Finally, these superstars have made it to the ring after a vicious surprise attack while entering. We'll just have to wait and see how that little scuffle alters the balance of power in this contest. Little scuffle? I think you're downplaying what we just saw unfold in front of us. And a shoulder. That's using your noggin. They're slamming their face down. Yeah. Yeah. Sent oh. into the corner. Yeah. This team working like a well oiled machine. Oh man, targeting the gut. That was that chemistry you cannot teach. Oh, heavy duty right hand. He catches Jimmy with a counter. He's able to sidestep there. Ooh. Caught him right in the jaw. Oh, what a shot. No escape from these punches. Stops. Each of those boots seem to get heavier with each. Oh my god! 
Let's take another look at these guys in action. Here are your winners, Solo Sokoa and Jimmy Uso. The You can throw everything you want at an opponent, but obviously that doesn't work on everyone. Yeah, Corey, but that was a tremendous effort considering the situation given. It's just not fair. Oh, there you go again. If you're looking for fair, you're in the wrong place.